Uh, throughout the Winter Olympics, throughout these current Winter Olympics, we're going to highlight some amazing athletes who have paved the way for others. David is back with us now, and today you are talking about a figure skater who broke barriers. We sure are. Her name is Debbie Thomas, and when she took the bronze medal at the 88 Winter Olympics in Calgary, she became the first African-American to medal at all ever in the Winter Games, though her journey, of course, hasn't been all awards and accolades. Take a look. Debbie Thomas began skating at age five and was winning figure skating competitions by the age of nine. In a sport that's historically white, Thomas challenged stereotypes and became a role model to black girls in a sport that didn't include them. Always determined to be the best she could be, she trained and competed at the highest level while also enrolled at Stanford University. Her education was just as important to her as her sport. The figure skating competition at the 1988 Winter Games in Calgary was highly anticipated. Dubbed the Battle of the Carmens because Thomas and Olympic favorite Katerina Witt both performed to music from the opera Carmen. Thomas stumbled in her performance, finishing third. Witt took home the gold. But Debbie Thomas's bronze medal secured her spot in history as the first African-American to medal in the Winter Olympics. After the Olympics, rather than pursuing a professional skating career, Thomas returned to school to become a doctor and later practiced as an orthopedic surgeon. Debbie Thomas was inducted into the U.S. Figure Skating Hall of Fame in 2000. Such history there. In 2015, Thomas revealed, though, that she'd fallen on hard times, including a substantial amount of debt. And this is heartbreaking. She had to surrender her Olympic medal back oh, to the Oh, my gosh, David, I totally did not hear about that. I mean, she was iconic back then. You just did not see African-American young women in that right. sport. We sure wish, wish her well.